I'm Kurt Heisey, I'm from Liberty SEMA Center Prizes, and I want to show to you today a typical setup for our SS4E roof panel machine. This is on a trailer that's uh, just 12 foot uh, by just a little bit better than 5 foot wide. The nice thing about a small trailer like this is that you are able to uh, get it into small places and to set up as a job. Uh, this customer here uh, has a 10,000 watt um, uh, generator that's going to power his machine. Uh, he has the expandable arbor uh, decoiler that feeds into his, this machine. This uh, coil right now is 24 inch wide. Uh, coil, 24 gauge. So this uh, SS4E will do the 24 gauge. Uh, on this machine, there's very small adjustments. This will adjust the, the width of the coil uh, on where you want. And this machine is specially outfitted with uh, our exit shear. So you can order this machine with the standard front and slitter shear, or you can add this option, which has the uh, exit shear. So to, uh, we set up one run out table here uh, to show the machine, and then the limit switch controls length control. So you can measure from the shear blade right to where the, uh, the you can feel this engage, and that will be your your distance. So every machine we have now really handily comes with a remote control. And so you can start, stop, jog, put it on automatic. Right from here, you can uh, be at the, uh, the end of 20 or 30 feet and still run your machine. You can stop it wherever you are. And extra storage uh, for runout tables is on the side with this customer's trailer. So a uh, very simple way to set up your machine and we believe that it's a very uh, um, useful way to uh, get it onto any job site that might be needed.